Family Gamer, and everything that families need to know about Street Fighter V. From what to watch out for to what makes this game great, this is the ultimate quick guide. Street Fighter V is the latest in the almost 30 year old series of martial arts fighting games. As ever, the game sees a variety of human opponents, often with fantastical qualities or fighting abilities, fighting each other one to one in contained arenas. Each fight is won on a best of three rounds basis, and each round is won by reducing an opponent's life bar to nothing. While the basic kicks, punches and blocks are easy to achieve with single button presses, players need fast reactions to master the combinations of stick moves and button presses required to execute some of the more spectacular combos. Although Street Fighter V is a game at pains to make sure even novices can learn the ropes without too much confusion. As well as previous Street Fighter games, Street Fighter V can best be compared to rival fighting games such as the far gorier Mortal Kombat series. An expansion adding a cinematic story mode to Street Fighter V is due for free release in June 2016, but until then the game has character story mode which explores the background of the combatants. Capcom, one of the most venerable Japanese publishers, have developed the game in-house in collaboration with Japanese fighter specialist Dimps, who also contributed to Street Fighter IV. Street Fighter V is available for PS4 and PC with cross-platform online multiplayer. The game costs £50 or $60, with a season pass including forthcoming downloadable characters, costing £25 or $30. On PS4, a PS Plus subscription is required to play online. Character Story Mode may only take two or three hours to complete, with the forthcoming Story Mode adding another couple of hours. But as an online multiplayer game, Street Fighter V will last as long as the player wants to take on online combatants. In the UK and Europe, Peggy rates Street Fighter V a 12 for violence in a sporting context and mild bad language. The game's rating authority expand on the Peggy details by saying that the game was given a 12 rating for frequent, non-realistic violence against human characters and the use of offensive language and mild swearing. Violence is highly stylized, with no permanent visible damage. Online play involves interacting with other people online, and parents should be aware of this. The words bastard, bloody, piss, wanks and bugger can be heard. Street Fighter V is very much virtual combat as virtual sport, with stylized violence taking place in a fantastic and exotic context with minimal consequences. Any story and themes are really just set dressing, with the core of the experience being the player's ability, or inability, to master the controls and new special moves and move up online rankings. Apart from some light swearing and generically sexy outfits, there's very little to offend or disturb anyone but the most ardent opponent to violence. But to be honest, what appears on screen is merely the spectacular fireworks to illustrate the competitor's ability to manipulate a controller or specialised arcade stick in fast and complicated ways. For all the talk of making Street Fighter V accessible, with tutorial and training modes to help newcomers hone their skills, the game's initial package is almost entirely focused on online play against human opponents. Casual and ranked matches as well as a fighter's network for finding players are available, with the only single player content being a short character story mode and survival mode which pits players against opponents with stringent restrictions and challenges. This emphasis on open competition will inevitably cause casual or new players to either sink or swim, and those who can't compete may find the game's full price tag steep for the opportunity to get beaten up by strangers. Thanks for watching our quick guide to Street Fighter V. Please let us know what you thought of the highs and lows of the game in the comments, and please subscribe for more family guides coming to you soon.